Hey guys, this is Modic here and this is my Xiaomi Redmi Note 4 Google Pixel edition. So a few weeks back, I made a video about getting the Google Pixel features on the OnePlus 3 and a lot of you guys asked me how can you do the same for the Redmi Note 4. So here I am with my Pixel edition Redmi Note 4 and today I'm going to tell you how can you do the same on your phone. Basically, we will be covering three things in this video which are installing an Android 7.1 Nougat ROM, getting the Google Pixel look and installing the Google Pixel features like the Google Assistant and the fingerprint gestures so let's get started to do this method there are some prerequisites which are your phone should have an unlocked bootloader and it should have a custom recovery like TWRP installed if you already have it installed then great but if you don't then don't worry i have a video about the same which you can watch by clicking the i button here or by clicking the link in the video's description so assuming that you do have an unlocked bootloader and a custom recovery now go to the link given in the video's description and download the android 7.1 custom rom for the redmi note 4 there are a few roms out there but i will be using the resurrection remix rom you also need to download the google apps package again the link to it is in the video's description Make sure that you select the Nano G apps package for Android 7.1 and ARM 64. Copy the ROM and G apps file onto your Redmi Note 4. Now power off your Redmi Note 4 and hold the volume up and the power button to enter the recovery mode. Inside recovery, go and wipe your data, cache, system and Dalvik cache. Once that is done, come back to the main menu, click on install and select your ROM and G apps package. Install them and let the phone do its work. It typically takes around 5 to 10 minutes to finish the install completely. Once the install is done, wipe the data and Dalvik cache again and now reboot your phone. Since this is the first boot, it's going to take some time, so have some patience. Once the phone boots up, you can now set it up and now you're finally running on Android 7.1.1 Nougat. To get the Google Pixel look, you need to download Nova Launcher and a Pixel icon pack. I already have a video about it so again click the i button here or you can find the link in the video's description. So once you have the Google Pixel look, it is now time to get some Google Pixel features onto your phone. To get the Google Assistant, just go and update your Google app as Google has made the assistant available on every phone now. Then go to settings, click on configuration, swipe over to buttons and here under home button, select the long press action to Google Now on tap. Now you should be able to pull up the Google Assistant by just long pressing the home key. Finally to get the fingerprint gestures on your Redmi Note 4, just download this app called Fingerprint Gestures from the Google Play Store. Using that I could toggle the notification tray by just swiping across the fingerprint sensor. Apart from that, this ROM also has a few built-in gestures for a lot of things and some other customization as well which is really awesome. So that's how you get the Pixel Edition Redmi Note 4. One thing which I would like to say is that since this ROM is in the initial stages there might be some random hiccups here and there at times. I have been using it since the past 10 to 12 days and it's been really good for the most part and it gives me a very decent battery life. So yeah, if you do want that pixel look and features, definitely try this out. Do like this video if you enjoyed watching it and if you have any questions then do drop them in the comments or just reach out to me on Twitter or Facebook. If you are new to this channel then definitely subscribe. and also press the bell icon so that you are notified when my new video comes out that's it for now thanks for watching and i will see you guys in the next video peace